Uh, welcome to Center of Math Advanced Knowledge Problem of the Week. Uh, for this week's problem, we want to prove that the sum of two nilpotent elements in a commutative ring is again nilpotent. Uh, so to prove this, first, with what we know, we know there's some n1 to the s1 equals 0 in this commutative ring, some n2 to the s2 equals 0 in this commutative ring. And uh, to do this problem, we just need to make one observation, really, and that's So the problem is equivalent to trying to find some q such that n1 plus n2 to the q equals 0. This would make this n1 plus n2 nilpotent again. So if we set q equal to s1 plus s2 and then expand out, we get n1 to the s1 plus s2 n1 to the s1 plus s2 minus 1 times n2 times s1 plus s2, da da da, until uh, we get n2 to the s1 plus n s2. And this is from the usual uh, expansion of you know, some product to some power. We can expand this way. And the one thing we need to know about this is that here uh, n1, n1 to any power greater than s1 is going to give us 0 because uh, anything times 0 is against 0. So n1 to the s1 plus s2 is greater than s1, so this is 0. This is uh, assuming, yeah, this is going to be 0 again. And the one thing we need to know here is that uh, either 1, either the power, of, the power of n1 plus the power of n2 equals s1 plus s2. So at least 1 of n1 or s2 has to have a power greater than s1 or s2. Because if they were both lower, we would get a sum lower than s1 and S2, giving us a contradiction. And so we know that each of these terms has to be 0, because at least 1 of the n1 to its power or n2 to its power is going to be 0. And so adding up all these, uh, we get 0. And this proves that n1 plus n2 is, again, nilpotent in our commutative ring. And note that it needs to be commutative. Otherwise, we would have issues with. Uh, when multiplying it out, we just want to group all the n1s together and all the n2s together. Uh, and yeah, uh, if you like this video, please check out our blog and check out centermath.org, and also follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you.